Yo, what is up? Welcome to Marco's Modern Life. It's your boy Mar. We are back with another video. Shout out to everyone who checked out the Air Jordan 13 playoff pickup vlog yesterday. If you haven't checked out that video, make sure watch this video, then go check out how we acquired the shoes through the pickup vlog yesterday. I would greatly, greatly appreciate that. Today, we definitely wanted to take a more in-depth look at the Air Jordan 13 playoff. Also, just kind of talk about the release because it was pretty surprising. It was pretty surprising with this release. It looks like for the most part online, the shoes are gone. They sold out. <laughs> and I know a lot of people thought that they would sit, including myself, I thought they would sit some places. I think in stores you can still find them. But online, for the most part, it was a sellout. So this release has done better than I even expected and probably a lot of other people expected. So I definitely wanted to talk about that, see how you guys felt about that. Take a better look at the shoe. Of course, we want to take a better look at the shoe and just see how we feel about them after we had a day to kind of look at them and think about it and all that and see if I'm still as excited today as I was yesterday when I picked up the pair. But before we get into all that, make sure like the video that helps us get out into the algorithm so we can continue to grow and live out our dreams. If you're in a dope sneaker content from a true sneakerhead, make sure to subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell so you don't miss any of the content. Leave comments. I always love to engage with you guys, see how you feel about the shoes, how your pair looks, if you copped them, if you set it out, all that good stuff. So make sure, leave a comment, and I'll definitely get back to you in the comment section. But without further ado, Let's take a look at the Air Jordan 13 playoffs. Air Jordan 13 playoff and Jordan brand did a great job with these just taking a look at the shoe you see we got the black leather upper with that suede as well and that suede is nice and soft <laughs> I love it I was very happy with the quality on my pair. You know, whenever you pick up a shoe, you kind of wonder, you worry how it's gonna come out, how it's gonna look, but these look nice. And I feel like they changed the shape of the 13 on these as well, because they don't look as bulky as some 13s that I picked up in the past. But man, these, these are nice, these are nice. I love the colorway, I love the black, the leather on these is really soft. That's something that I was actually very surprised with, the softness of that leather because some other 13s that I've caught, man, it's been like kind of like a brick <laughs> on that toe box. But man, even on the toe box, we got that soft leather. You see, we got Jordan there in yellow. We got the black laces, the suede on the tongue. We got the jump man in red with the yellow circle around it on the tongue. It's just a nice pair of shoes, a very, very nice sneaker. Something that's really wearable. You can get a lot of wears out of. You see we got the white pods on the bottom there. And then just looking at the bottom, we got the gray, the red, the black, the carbon fiber with the bubble jump man there. I just love the bottom of the 13. It's such a dope, dope look on it. But man, they, they really, in my opinion, really did this shoe justice. The quality on my pair is up to par. There's not many glue stains or anything like that that I have on my shoe. There's a, there's a couple things, but nothing that I'm really gonna complain about or get too upset about because man, this is a nice looking shoe. Very excited that I can actually have these in hand and having these in hand, 
I'm satisfied. Definitely satisfied. We know the retail on these was $210, which is a hefty price. But when I look at it, when I feel the materials, the softness of the leather and all that, it really does feel premium. It, it feels premium to me. Now, I know the leather probably really isn't premium leather. It's probably not even real leather. But I like the touch of it. I like the look of it. I think they did a good job with this. We got that famous hologram on the Air Jordan 13. Let me know if you take the plastic off your hologram. I leave mine on, but let me know if you leave the plastic over your hologram or if you take it off. Man, this is just such a nice shoe. Air Jordan 13 playoff. Back for All-Star. Back for the All-Star break, which is where Jordan broke these out during the All-Star game. So the fact that they released them during All-Star Weekend, I thought that was appropriate. And I think that's probably something that was calculated by Jordan Brand. But man, they, they did a great job with these. And I haven't checked resale on the shoe, but I would say if you're thinking about getting this shoe, I would say get it. The quality's up to par, it's a great colorway. I don't think you could go wrong with rocking it. And I mean, you could get a lot of wears out of this shoe just based off that colorway. And resale prices shouldn't be too bad. So if you have the opportunity to cop, you could probably still walk into a store and grab this shoe. And I think that would be something to consider doing just because it is a beautiful shoe. It's an OG classic shoe. Jordan put in work in these shoes, which <laughs> you, you gotta have it. In my opinion, you gotta have it. These are head turners, must cop in my opinion. Man, I'm just really happy with the shape. Really happy with the look, the quality. Man, these are, it's just beautiful. It's a beautiful shoe. See the suede there. The black leather, man. It's just, I just love looking at them. I love looking at them. I love the way these ended up coming out. Definitely glad I could get my hands on this shoe. Let me know if you were able to cop. I think there was plenty of pairs to go around, so if you put in footwork, I, you probably got your pair. But I did see a couple comments, or at least one comment yesterday, that someone took an L, wasn't able to get their pair. I don't know if they tried to look in store or not or anything, but I feel like if, if you look in store, you probably will find some pairs sitting. Because I saw other people say they took L's on raffles, but they were able to just walk into a store and pick up a pair, which is great, man, because... These are definitely classics, and it's definitely something you want to have in the collection, in my opinion. Now, I know there's other things coming out as well that maybe you're saving for, but man, you cannot go wrong with the Air Jordan 13 playoff. Definitely a dope release for this year. Quality's on point, and I'm very excited about that. Yeah, so again, guys, the Air Jordan 13 playoff, definitely head turner. Must cop in my opinion, but that is my opinion. Leave a comment. Let me know how you feel about it. Let me know if you went after, if you set it out, if you took a W, if you took an L, all that good stuff. I know we got some more heat dropping. We got the Air Jordan 12 our mom and years dropping, I believe with the 24th. So coming up this next week, which both colorways are nice in that shoe, but I like the white one better. So I'm definitely going to be going after those. Hoping I can get my hands on those. You know, 12 is my favorite silhouette, my favorite. Jordan so I'm hoping I can snag a pair of those because that's a very nice shoe we also got the the um, reimagined white cement threes coming which is a banger the Air Jordan 5 UNC's I mean we got a lot of heat coming up and this was a good way to really I would say start the year because man other than the true blue ones this has been my only cop so far this year and this is definitely a good one and it was definitely worth the wait because they did their thing on this shoe. Very, very nice shoe. Man, it just looks great. Just looks great. I love it, I love it. Everything about it is nice. But that's my opinion. Like I said, let me know how you feel. Let me know what you're looking forward to. But I appreciate you guys tuning in as we take another look at the Air Jordan 13 playoff. But that is all we got. I appreciate you guys tuning in and taking another look at the Air Jordan 13 playoff with me. Talking about the release, I'm surprised at how well this shoe did, but that is dope. I'm glad that a OG, a classic OG, got the respect that it deserves, at least selling out online. 
dope. I didn't really expect that to happen, but I'm glad to see it. I'm glad to see it, and I'm glad I was able to get my pair, and hopefully you were able to get yours as well. I appreciate you guys tuning in. Make sure to like the video. That helps us get out in the algorithm so we can grow and live out our dreams. If you're in the dope sneaker content from a true sneakerhead, make sure to sub to the channel. We on the road to 2K. As soon as we get there, we are doing the giveaway. So tell a friend, tell a friend, subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell so you don't miss any of the content. Leave comments like we talked about, and I'm definitely going to get back to you guys because I enjoy the engagement. But man, I appreciate you guys tuning in. It's your boy, Mar, checking out. Stay blessed. Live your life. Peace.